basically the tweet said something about see yourself, be yourself. But it seemed like a lot of the athletes really latched on to that. See yourself, be yourself, right? Because, I, you know, when we talk about the zone, most people think it's, you know, funnel, 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 laser beam focus. And I think that is partially true. I think that's incomplete. I think the zone is actually being hyper aware. Hyper aware. And what most athletes will tell you, um, that zone is actually somewhat of a surreal experience. And, and, and you know, I've felt it, been fortunate enough to, to feel it myself and fortunate enough to actually help train people with that and, you know, practice it myself. But it's almost like you're doing your thing and you're watching yourself do your thing. Seeing yourself be yourself. And how do we get to that state? Right? How do we get to that state? And I remember when I was taking my test or studying for my licensing exam and they were talking about brain waves and what the optimal brain state was for, you know, taking a test. And I got it wrong because I didn't refer to the books because the books would say you need to be in a beta state, which is an alert state. And I'm thinking, no, <laughs> I actually chose a more relaxed state, you know, somewhere between alpha and theta where we're kind of alert, but like crossing in and out of that consciousness, right? Getting into that flow. And so there's a lot of techniques that we can do. And we actually, a lot of athletes know that technique. They just haven't honed it in or realized how they were doing it or how to train it so that it's more automatic. Um, but it's very possible to do it. And you know, that's probably one of my favorite things about this perception is, is, you know, what is, what are we saying to ourselves as we drop in, as we get on the gate, as we line up, as we, you know, send off our entry fee money, you know, what is that inner dialogue, you know, is what we're feeling worth what we want, you know, does how do I feel right now is that worth what I want later? Because chances are, you know, you may not be happy <laughs> as you're doing the thing that you most love or you're most passionate about. You may not. However, we can trick ourselves into a place where whether you're happy or not, or even sick or not, or nervous or not, that you can be in that place to where you can achieve that, that zone, right? Seeing yourself do your thing as you're doing it almost every time, automatically. Will it guarantee the win? I don't know, especially in contests which are judged. I mean, there's, there's plenty of controversy going on with most judged sports. Um, but the point is that, that it is possible for us to get into that Zen-like, Buddha-like state. Um, and it takes a bit of breathing, takes a bit of intention and practice and, and that's what we like to do here at the Mind Studio is help people harness their strengths and abilities so that their, their brains and bodies can find that zone more naturally and automatically.